All right, you guys, man, you guys finally convinced me. Actually, I was going to do this anyway. So shout out to Maynard James Keenan with his group, A Perfect Circle. We got Judith. We're doing an official music video. So let's get to it. Question, how can one man manage two other different groups outside of Tool? Is it because, it, well, depending on how, it, how long it takes Tool to make music and create albums, you got to have something in between. So I, maybe I just answered my own question. <laughs> Like homie, uh, his vocal delivery kind of reminds me of uh, the guy from Incubus. Is sitting up here calling out the entire doctrine of Christianity. And I get it. I get it. I really do. I really get it. Because you had all this faith and then you had all this, then you had a whole bad situation happen to you. And it's not fair. And I think he's really lyrically trying to encompass all that with the background vocals shouting and then the accusation. You know what I mean? Um, that no matter, you know, you're by yourself, that your God is not here. That's what he's physically saying. You know what I'm saying? It's not like you killed somebody. It's not like you drove a spear into his side. You know, it's, you, it's, it's definitely something to think about. <laughs> Way he's gonna go lyrically with this. Hold up, did homegirls tie herself up in a bun right before the drop for the beat? <laughs> he said, James was like, man, let me get this water, just like a battle. <laughs> Look at that. Like, my hair's in the way. Took the pick out of her mouth. Look 
interesting. I really like the tag team that they did on that verse, like the back and forth and the vocal, the vocal pitch and their delivery actually matched each other. I like how at the end of some of the bars, you had the other singer scream in the back and kind of paint that frustration. Like, I want to go back and listen to that. I like that. Oh, wow. I'm liking the guitar work right here. Intensity in James's voice, bro. In Maynard's voice. He calling him James. But in that intensity in Maynard's voice, bro. It's, ah, dude, I just, in the way it's mixed down, that audio engineer need to be making a million dollars, bro. That's some high top quality mastering right there. <laughs> I like that harmonizing right there. Oh, about 15 seconds right there. I like it. I'm feeling it. It's definitely got that hard rock energy, but it's also, uh, it's got a message. And James, I mean, Maynard is going to keep it <laughs> with a message, bro. He ain't going to get out of control with it, as far as I know. Let me see. What year was this? 14 years ago, 2009, it was posted. 59 million views. Um, It's remastered. Remastered in HD. Okay. I really like that. It, the message seemed very challenging, though. It's like he's confronting the hypocrisy in the, in, the, in, in the doctrine itself. You know what I'm saying? Like, look what all, like, it ain't like you a killer. It ain't like you speared him on the side and you still going, you know, you someday you're going to get paralyzed for doing that. But you didn't even do all that, but you're going to end up being paralyzed for some random accident. And I'll tell you, man, it's definitely a challenge for the human psyche to be able to concept that the God, your God is perfect beyond all means. And he will help you get through whatever you have to get through, no matter what the trials that you got to face. And so for some people, even through those type of situations, man, he holds them together because outside of yourself, what do you have? You have to have something to hold on to. You know, I wonder if that was the message, man. I think that's how I interpret this song. So let me know, man, how you guys feel about this reaction. Let me know if you guys want to see more Perfect Circle on the channel. And what's that other group that he had, too? Because I want to go check out some of that music as well. So let me know. See y'all at another one. Peace.